Clive Ratton, UK Country Manager for Etihad Airways here at uh, Excel and WTM. Very welcome. Clive, uh, just come uh, fresh from the World Travel Awards last night, where I understand you won two awards. Congratulations. Um, I just, uh, what was it like to win the world's leading airline award, such a prestigious award? Well, yeah, I mean, it's, it's incredibly exciting and a, a wonderful um, award for us to win just being six years old. So it really shows the work that we've done and what a fantastic product we've got has been recognised by the industry and um, the public alike. So very exciting. Well, congratulations on that. And as I mentioned, you won two awards and the other one was for best first class. Now, obviously, that's recently been introduced, so that's quite an accolade to win that so soon. Yeah, well, it must be really good to say it's just been flying on London for a couple of months now. Um, but that, again, it just means so much to uh, put a product into the market and then to be recognized so quickly as the world's leading first class. Can you tell me a little bit more about why you think you won it? What's so amazing about it? Um, well, it's the whole service. Of course, the seat and the suite that uh, we've got on the stand here today shows exactly what that, that product is, and that is incredible with the, uh, the great leather seats and all the amenities that are around it. But it's around the cabin service, you know, the food and beverage uh, managers we have on board and the whole approach that we have to the service uh, in first class and not forgetting what we offer on the ground as well with fantastic lounges. So now, you know, when somebody's traveling first class, they get a great product all the way through. I think that's why. Okay, you mentioned the lounges. Obviously, you've moved recently to Terminal 4 and you've got a new lounge. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, I'd be delighted to because it's great. We've got our own uh, lounge there, as you say, with a spa. Um, it's an uh, almost identical copy of what we've got in uh, Abu Dhabi. So, you know, it, it's beautiful. And I think everybody that's been through it loves it, and that's great. Uh, it really adds to our product. Okay, that's fantastic. And obviously, there's a lot of news going on at the moment. The other big one is that you've got this code share with Flybee. Again, tell us what that means to, to Etihad. Yeah, well, that, that is really uh, very good news for us here in the UK. It, it adds on a number of uh, UK domestic cities as well as feeding through uh, their services into Paris and Manchester and various other European ports. So it gives both our customers, Flybee and ours, more options to be able to travel worldwide um, with, you know, on two great airlines. So very excited about that. Okay, that's great. Um, and then, obviously, again, always with Etihad, there's new routes being launched. Can you again run us through uh, the latest things that are happening and maybe take a look forward to 2010 as well? Yeah. Um, we've just about uh, launched Hyderabad in, uh, in India now um, and we've got coming up early next year Tokyo and uh, Nagoya and flying back into Colombo as well in Q1 2010. Are there any other, any other developments you'd like to talk about, anything new that's happening with Etihad that we perhaps we haven't covered? Uh, well, I think we've covered pretty much everything there. We've, uh, you know, the business class uh, seat will be changing later in this year as well, some improvements there. But other than that, it's uh, very much rolling out the first class and uh, developing that product. Tell us a bit more about that business class seat. Uh, it's just uh, an enhancement to the already great business class product that we've got, which is uh, you know, voted uh, the best business class in Sky. So we've just got to keep working on it. Uh, it's around the uh, soft furnishings and everything uh, around the seat. So look forward to that a bit later on this year. Fantastic. Clive, thank you very much indeed for your time.